the Underworks on the ball now against Polly Doran. Early ball, and it's bending through the area. Miscommunication by Nevin and Dumont, and Dumont saves the day. Casey Dumont not happy about it either. Well, that perhaps could have, but wasn't the opening goal for Dylan Holmes. Chidiak. Polly Doran looking to get forward, looking to try and keep Adelaide accountable because they're targeting her flank. Doran's cross, Privatelli with a flick header. And it goes wide to the near side. And Leah Privatelli, who did score a double against Adelaide in round one. Isn't Tiff Eliadis has got a great leap as well. And Nevin tried to catch out Grove, lands it on the roof of the net. Not the worst idea, but ultimately over the bar. I'm with you, Teo. That was a, a very clever idea. Wanted to catch Grove off her line. Focusing so much on that in-swinging cross. It was open, just didn't get the angles right. Chidiak to Zimmerman, early ball, and a totally unmarked Primatelli! Liam Primatelli puts victory into a 1-0 lead, and the defending champions say, not so fast, Adelaide, we have come to play. What an assist from Catherine Zimmerman here, picks out Privatelli on that far post who timed her run beautifully. As we see on the Harvey Norman replay, clever little one-two here on the left boot, curls this perfectly to Privatelli, who makes no mistake. And Leah Privatelli, who scored a double against Adelaide in the first round of the season, continues her hot streak against the team in red. Sasaki is going to take on the surprise! What a golden finish from Sasaki. She's tricked everyone watching there. She's tricked Casey Dumont caught off her line. And what a finish on the Harvey Norman replay. That is pinpoint perfection from the young Japanese star. Now Condon breaks central, just great vision. Knew exactly where Fiona Wirtz was. And the pass holds up on the turf, but Wirtz can still go to work. Early shot, parried, it sits up, Holmes denied at close range. And for the second time today, Casey Dumont, who has saved the ball here with her face, has denied Dylan Holmes. He's already been sent off once this season, Amy Jackson, so we'll have to be careful. Now Chidiak, neat touch, Eliadis fires, and fires wide. Looked promising off the boot, but just continued to sail away from the net. Half time at Cooper Stadium, it's Adelaide United 1, Melbourne Victory 1. Isabel Hodgson, long diagonal ball, what vision. And Chelsea Dorber, isolated against Polly Doran. Dorber wants her right foot. Dorber can't keep it down, bending a few rows back in the stands. moments like that it's maybe all it takes Chelsea Dorber squaring up Polly Doran does all the right work to open up but just gets her foot underneath the ball there Lynn Rez able to shrug the attention of McNamara Privatelli has been the main outlet for victory so far this time loads up across it's going to fall to Rez! a moment for Melina Ayres, barely played all season, gets one chance and she converts and it has been this Privatelli right hand side with the floating ball in plenty of space, all the work to be done here though, no one tracking Melina Ayres, poor defending from Adelaide but cool, calm and collected on the Harvey Norman replay. And caught in possession by Sasaki, Amir, are there gaps now for Adelaide to exploit? Here's Dorba. Evans making a run. Dorba just biding her time on the ball. Wurtz waits in the middle. Still Dorba cuts it back. Shadine Evans bending a shot and into the gloves of Casey DeMonts. The runs are there. They're starting to come, Teo. Not enough intensity for my liking. Such a prolific attacking footballing team. 
Well, it's no time to stop and pause. Throw in here, Mullen. And that pass rolls down to Casey Dumont. Stoppage time expires. And without even so much as a signature chance to try and score an equaliser, it looks as though Adelaide are going to falter. The title defence is still alive for the Melbourne victory. They come to Adelaide and win. It's heartbreak for Adelaide on their first trip to the finals. And Melbourne victory set up a derby against their city rivals in the preliminary final. Full time at Coopers Stadium, Adelaide United 1, Melbourne victory 2.